Let's take it in turns. You rest. I'll stand guard. Hey! Over here! You're easy to spot. <laughs> A new arrival like you should get it. Yeah? So what? I go out all the time to see patients. So, uh, I won't charge anything for my services. Except for... F and if you get into medical trouble... Gastrointestinal discomfort, sprain... It's called an all-inclusive package. Huh? Hurry up! Do you want the snacks to sell out? <laughs> We've reached our destination. Our the folk dishes at Spices Supreme are a must try. This is the only place on the lawful. <laughs> yeah. Recommend? I think you mean I would start with the snack stands. You can browse around for a bit. I should see what the other customers have to say about the food here. Same great taste. Oh, interested in the food? In Aramali, there's no such thing as a bet. My name's Shaohan. I'm originally from Aramali, but this is my first visit in a long time. Are you feeling adventurous or cautious? If you're really feeling adventurous, you could try some mung bean soda. I describe the taste as unique and a little sour. It's best to drink it in big gulps and let it fizzle in your stomach. That's a great... Oh, a visitor from afar. May I ask you? Then I'll have to make sure your first visit... I hope you don't mind me prattling on, but since you're an outworlder... That's true, and they made it much more convenient. Well, I can't just leave you here empty-handed. Take a look at the menu, or... Alrighty. Is there any... Mung bean soda? Okay, you drink it then. <laughs> it's just like drink. Ah, it's the dragon lady. He huh? Wait, Auntie, I'm not thirsty, please. I'm so full of... I wanted to stop by Elegance Pagoda to buy some medicine jars while I'm out. Come on! Hey! What's going... <sighs> some of the dock workers got into an argument. Watch your words! No need to be aggressive here. How about we go see what's happening at the dock? When did you decide to show up, little Miss Feisty? How is this any of your business? Please, miss, allow 
Starroom Alley Merchant Guild to take care of this. You're from the Merchant Guild? What a joke. You people can't take care of anything. Everyone here knows that our Room Alley Merchant Guild is as incompetent as it is dysfunctional. The lease for the docks isn't even paid yet. Anyone care to... I'll tell you. The Merchant Guild. I'm not denying that. Then say it out loud so everyone can hear. Our Room Alley Merchant Guild apologizes to every vendor here for defaulting. Better yet, get down on your knees and beg for forgiveness. Wait! Easy! We just came to watch! Uh, you're being completely unreasonable. I'm not being unreasonable. I'm making a friendly inquiry. When will the IPC receive its lease payments? I'm afraid we can't pay at the moment. We leased this whole dock to your merchant guild, hoping that it would rejuvenate our room alley. And look at it now. A perfectly good freight dock. They said at the moment. That doesn't mean they'll never make the payments. Right. Ah, <laughs> don't be so gullible. How about we make a little bet? If the Merchant Guild can pay back the money it owes, I'll get down on my knees and apologize to all the people of our room alley. I'll shout it loud and clear. I'm a raving idiot howling into the wind. And then I'll bark like a dog. How does that sound? Okay. And if they can't? Oh, that's simple. You apologize to me in front of all the people of our room alley, and you bark like a dog. Ugh, you're not being very helpful, are you? <laughs> Deal. <laughs> you all heard that, right? I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> Come on, let's get out of here. Miss, there's no reason for you to take such a bet. It's okay. Seeing that air... We appreciate you sticking up for us. Now that I think about it, if I lose the bet, it'll reflect badly on the Cloud Knights. But you can't give in to bullies. My name is Ming Shi. I'm the secretary of Arum Alley Merchant Guild. Most people just call me Miss Secretary. This leasing dispute is between the IPC and the Merchant Guild. You shouldn't have been dragged into it. Sure is. I've already started placing bets. So, is it true that the Merchant Guild can't pay back the lease? Uh, Miss Secretary, just tell it like it is. As things stand now... The Merchant Guild is in no position to pay back the lease. If we make the businesses more profitable, then maybe... If we cut costs and tap into new revenue streams, we can turn things around. A, a lot of vendors and... What about cutting costs? Cutting costs means reducing expenses. As you can see, the dock isn't even fully... Uh, hey, 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 don't get any funny ideas about late... Miss Secretary is just helping us think of ideas. But if you ask me, I think our ordering system is rather inefficient. I'm sure we could... I didn't realize you were such an entrepreneur. Even the president hasn't been able to solve anything. Is this short lifer really...
Don't worry. Our motto is safe. Hey, what's gotten into you? Uh, impressive, but uh, if you ask me, inventory efficiency isn't enough to save a. I see your point. If you have the time, could you accomplish? Of course. It's just I'm better with brawn than brain. Mr. Young Fung? Why, it's Miss Secretary. And who do we have? I'm Su Shang of the Cloud Knights. I think you already know the little girl with horns on her head. And this. Good to meet you all. Uh, Miss Secretary, I heard you made a bet with the IPC. And if you lose, you have to bark. The word got out pretty quickly, huh? Yeah. Those outworlders from the IPC are the worst. How did you get bogged down with them? Right. And if the Merchant Guild pay back what they owe, the only one barking will be that IPC. We made our inventory more efficient. But the dock workers said we still need a way to distribute. Those dock workers don't want to take responsibility. And I'm afraid... Then who should we blame? The IP... Oh, the IPC said that they would handle operations at all Mallet and promised to give subsidies to the vendors. I suspect they secretly told all the vendors not to use the dock for logistics. We can only blame ourselves for letting them get away with it for so long. If we can't pay back the rent, the financial damages will be manageable. But the reputational damage will be irreparable. If the Merchant Guild loses everyone's trust, it'll become an empty shell of its former self. And without the Merchant Guild, the IPC will have no competitors in Arum Alley's business district. The IPC wants to turn this place into a big logistics warehouse. By then, the food hawkers and used goods stores will have to move away. Ah, uh, so no more- Correct. The physical space will still exist, but the Aurum Alley we all know, its fragrances, its bustling tourists, will be nothing more than a memory. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. On the logistics side, we can reduce costs by making sure the delivery- Mr. Young Fung, please allow our friend to try his hand- after the Ambrosial Arbor disaster, the use of Jade Abakai, also the duties of a merchant guild. With these routes in place, logistics costs will be reduced significantly. I knew it! You're the heroes who can- Now can you tell us what really happened to- Well, Arum Alley was originally the busiest night market in Exalting Sanctum. In days past, this alley, famed for its food and commerce, was bri- Restrictions were placed on civilian arumatons, and new commercial centers began to spring up. It was like being on a gentle downhill slope. Everyone, when the Lawfu was moored for maintenance and trade with the IPC increased, a new threat emerged for the Merchant Guild. The IPC's announcement of a bid for the development of Arum Alley. Their promises were written when the gentle downhill slope suddenly became the edge of a cliff. No one could pretend to ignore it anymore. 
Therefore, on behalf of the Merchant Guild, I would like to formally... Oh, excellent. Why don't you talk it over with everyone? I really hope you can... You don't want me to have to bark like a dog in front of all those people, do you? Besides, my home, the Sienjo Yaoqing, had much closer ties with the IPC. But gradually, the Yaoqing's younger generations began to enjoy the immersion after their coming-of-age ceremonies. Uh, the architecture across the whole dell began to change. The graceful flying eaves I saw as a child became many of the Yaoqing locals older than 500. And when I saw Mingxi being confronted by the... If our opponents were... I want to help the Merchant Guild. <sighs> I only came here for the food. Still, if you're willing to give it a shot... I knew you'd help us! What do you think? Great. I still haven't discussed any of this with the president. Miss Lian Yen, please tell the president that I have someone who can help us with the leasing situation. I'll go ask the president's opinion on the matter. Please wait a moment. Okay, the president trusts Miss Secretary's judgment, but the applicant... The president acknowledges your expertise and agrees to confer management response. Arum Alley Merchant Guild would like to issue a formal request. Now that you'll be able to help the dock workers do the inventory and help Heronix, I keep tabs on all the goings on in Arum Alley, including rumors and the latest gossip. If we can solve some of if it involves helping people in need. Sure, just come see me at the dock when you have- You'll be able to help the dock workers do the inventory. I keep tabs on all the goings on in our- Anytime you need- The important thing right now is to generate- I'll be off to the dock then. <laughs> 